are running today, Hindustan, Copper, Analco, mm. MMTC. Is anything brewing? Well, uh, Rima, there's, I don't know whether there's something brewing, but they're coming out with their set of numbers. All these three companies that okay. you mentioned that are running along. In the next one week, uh, we'll hear from them. You know, let's start off with Nalco first. Um, the reason may be that uh, the street is building in a good set of numbers. Nalco, in the recent past, they, have, uh, they used to make aluminum. Then they started cutting down on aluminum production. And in fact, they started focusing on the aluminum business. And aluminum as well as aluminum, both of them are flirting with their uh, two-year highs. So let's get some graphics as well up for you on the screen in terms of uh, Nalco. Um, in terms of MMTC, uh, the market capitalization is more than 5,600 crores approximately. For FY16 itself, if we just take a look at those, uh, at their numbers, I don't know, the stock is up 10%, maybe it goes up 20%, but you need to look at the financials as well. Uh, market capitalization of 5,600 crores, they made an EBIT loss of around 112 crores. Thank God they had some other income, which was 170 crores, and that's why the profitability came in at around 66, uh, uh, 66 crores. That tells you that the stock is trading at around 80, 85x, um, it's trailing multiple, so... I don't know what sense it makes, you know, for uh, to get the stock being up close to around 10%. Maybe there's something we don't know. But fundamentally, I think uh, really this is uh, reflecting only exuberance. Um, let's focus on the other stock uh, that we are talking about, Hindustan Copper. Copper is trading at its highest levels we've seen in the last 18 months. Remember, they provide uh, concentrate uh, so to, uh, to Hindalco as well as uh, Vedanta, one of the biggest producers of concentrate. So they're not really producing copper. Just keep that in mind. Though copper... Since it's in the cycle, it's at 18 months highs, etc. The stock is up close to around 4% as we speak. Now, um, there's very speculation that demand will improve in the United States. We've seen better numbers coming out of China. So maybe copper will hold on to these uh, levels. But fundamentals, need to focus on that. 6,000 crores of market capitalization in FI16. A bit loss of around 130 crores. Again, other income saved them. And uh, they delivered a loss as well, uh, net loss of around 104 crores. So that's because they had share of uh, loss in terms of an associate. But I don't know whether the stock Lima should have uh, run up uh, so much uh, any which ways. And we have seen the government constantly divest uh, stakes. So, I mean, just uh, fundamentally, I don't think MMTC as well as uh, uh, Hindustan Copper should be up 3, 4, 5 or 10%. Okay, Nigel, thank you so much for that.